Hey, how's it going everyone? This is Whip from Wits End Media and today we're going to be talking about source tape. So first off, let's open up DaVinci Resolve. So now that we have DaVinci Resolve open, um, let's throw in some clips. I got four clips right here. Um, not in particular, just stuff I found online, just some B-roll stuff um, to change the frame rate. And from here, let's go to the cut page, or not the cut page, not edit, and select all your clips. Well, before even we do that, um, if you come up here to this corner right here, you'll see this icon and it says source tape. And if you guys are familiar with how clips work, if you double click it, it will pull up this little viewer and you can go like in. So if you want right there, so like when she's done or something like right in there, you can click out and then you can click F12 to a, um, it appends to the end. So basically it will just throw um, whatever that in an out value is onto your timeline. But what's nice about the source clip is that you can, let's just delete this, um, you can click all, select all the clips you want. It doesn't, if you only want a certain, if you just want like only this three, but let's click, select all four and let's click the source tape. Now it will show all four clips on the same thing. So if, if, if you have a, like a lot of B-roll and you're just, this is, this could be a faster way to splice through it also if like, Okay, so I only want from here, and ooh, I just did that wrong. Ah, I'm just gonna restart. I clicked wrong button. So if I just want from in all the way to so right here, oh, append to end, and then I can go to the next clip, and I like, let's say, right here to here, click F12, append to N, and then this clip, uh, say from here to here, I like that, so then append to N, and then on this clip from here, clicking I, and then O, and then F12, append to N. So this can be a really fast way of just getting the clips you want and not having to cut through. Like if we were, like let's go to our edit page, right? And let's just delete all this for a second. And let's say we didn't use that source tape. I just throw all these clips on here. Then I have to go through control B, control B, delete, delete. And then do that again for our, all four of these clips. I just gotta find where I want this. And this can work but it's very tedious and takes way longer, especially for B-roll. I mean, for some instances, this is what you have to do just because the way that, like, if you have a lot of audio going on and you're, like, want to, like, sync stuff up and, you know, with people talking and all that stuff and audio, this is probably what you're going to have to do, but especially for B-roll, you can literally just go into this edit page, select them all, click source tape, and you can see all your stuff, and you can just click I, O, and F12. Like, those are the three buttons you need to know. And it just makes the editing process so much faster. So that's a quick tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and check out some of my other stuff. Uh, thanks for watching, and have a great day.